Somebody <laughs> or something or some institutions are not doing something right. Oh, hmm. did I, how well did I do? You did, you tried. It's all right, man. <laughs> so, uh, about three weeks plus ago, or just a little bit under a month, this yeah. text came into my, my phone and it goes, Dear Mr. Messicano, welcome to it's blah, 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 bank. bank. Mm -hmm. Your new account number is 1578334. Phone, okay, phone 919. Ah, that's a little bit Dial, there's a code. Yeah, if yeah. I give you the code, you know. Visit yeah. www. to enjoy easy banking. And now, this bank, I have never had any. Never stepped I've into never, it. We've never had, I've never had. Maybe when they were, okay, if I say that one, you know the bank. Yeah. But then, another text comes in that your DBA monthly fee has been reviewed and all that. Oh, wow. And so, this has been for, yeah, it's been on my So, I just left it on my phone, mm -hmm. right? And then yesterday, now this happened yesterday, I go to this particular thread on social media, mm -hmm. and then I see a number of people who are calling out banks, about three or four of them. Mm -hmm. Wow. And then some even went as far as sending messages to this particular bank, yeah. and then one actually got a response that these people actually know what they're doing. Mm -hmm. Some accounts are being opened with people's mm -hmm. names yeah. and details. Some don't have pictures yeah. in yeah. banks. Even in banks that you already have an existing account. account. They're opening yeah. duplicate yeah. accounts for yeah. you. So yeah. this was what I did. I tagged the bank. I didn't get a response. And then under the, the bank, I now tagged Central Bank. Yeah. And that was... You yeah. get a response. Then. And they now told yes. me, uh, come into the deal. Oh, God. Oh, God. Calm down. Yeah. 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 Oh, God. Don't be shut off your mic. So off your mic. I didn't say... I will say the DM today, but... Yes. I called someone in Abuja who, who knows someone in ICP Center. was like, oh, yes, this is going to happen to a friend of mine. Mm -hmm. She walked into her bank. She has an existing account. And then she goes, I didn't. Why did you get... And there's a second account with her name. Mm -hmm. Didn't you have the same experience I had exactly the same thing. I went to open a dollar account. And then all of a sudden, she's sending me two account details. She's telling me, oh, no, one is dollar. One is Naira. And I'm like, oh, OK, I, oh, I have what? enough Naira. Yeah, I want I, a I dollar. And she's account. telling me that, oh, no, sorry. I just thought... You didn't think, think, don't think sister. For me. What I, just, I collected one form. Yeah. I filled one form. Mm -hmm. Why did you duplicate? Do you understand? The so you try to me now. She just was just being proactive. I said, mm -mm. and don't be. But proactive. at least you walked into the same bank and then they duplicated an account mm -hmm. for you. But where you yeah. did not have any relationship with a bank and then the you opened accounts for you, like that's, in your, yeah, in your that's case. Crazy. But this is the thing. This is what you should expect when people are put under pressure and then you have a platform where banks can simply just go and retrieve information from and yeah. just help you know. Yeah. I'm talking about the whole BVN platform now. Yeah. And yes. that's what they're doing. Yes. They're opening accounts based on the information the data that they already have. Mm -hmm. Now, talking about the pressure that I mentioned from earlier, my wife works at a bank, I'm not telling you which one, mm -hmm. and I can tell you what pressures these people actually go through yeah. to open yeah, these new accounts. Right. It is so overwhelming that sometimes she's like, I'm done, and then tomorrow again she's wearing her suit <laughs> and she's going back yeah. there. Yeah. It is a means to open more accounts, more and more and more accounts. And yep. I don't know whether lines could be drawn. Mm. I don't know whether there are any lines to be so, drawn. I don't know whether they have any rights to actually take your information more and then start accounts. More accounts mean more dues and more fees. All those tiny Very trickle true. monies yes, yes, that come into yes, the bank. Yes. It means that they can charge. And I do believe there's some fine print somewhere in the very first form you filled with that bank, if you did fill a form with that bank, that says that they have the right to you know, use this information within the bank. Mm -hmm. so, um, so I received a call you know, saying that, oh, I was eligible for a particular loan facility, mm. right? But in order to access that loan you facility, have have you have to open have another an account. account. I'm like, okay. <laughs> so, yeah, but that's the thing. At least that's you know that they're going to do that. What is wrong with using that very same account for the loan facility? Isn't mm -hmm. it going to be based on what is going into that very so first account? So they want to attract those extra deals. So why do I need mm. a second account for mm -hmm. you to be able to give me... In the there end, is also the, I just ended up just saying no. no. There yeah. is also the instance where if you use certain apps, mm -hmm. then they open uh, um, related fresh accounts, one. fresh accounts for you mm -hmm. uh, with other banks. You are not, sometimes you're, you're alerted to the fact that if you want to use this app, we're going to open this account for you. Yeah. But I, I have used one of those apps, and then all of a sudden I got a text from a bank saying, welcome, hey. hey. So what happens what's like, that? I don't so what know happens you that Sometimes, like you said, they notify you, yeah. but then it's in their terms and conditions that yes. we're doing this. Uh, under this fintech app or something. Yeah. Perhaps give, I didn't read yeah. the fine print. So mm, it's, it's print. there. So, but now the point we're trying to say is that where is the line being drawn? Mm -hmm. If somebody should want to loan the money and put something into there, I will be picked up. Are you receiving mm -hmm. details of I receive the details. So I, just, I, so I, 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 I send that message and then I, I'll keep it all down. So if something happens tomorrow mm -hmm. and all that, I say, yeah. look, yes. Benny, I, I, and I, I tag yeah. Central Bank. Yeah. Yes. My point is, the central bank, ICPC, whatever body is responsible for mm -hmm. this, mm -hmm. 
I think this shouldn't be happening. Uh, there, so now, there, need uh, to be, there needs to be some sort of um, investigation or yeah. at least uh, let the customers know exactly where your rights are yeah, and definitely. how far these banks can go with all of your details. For me, yeah. the details are the problem because if you have my details, yeah. you can do anything with, with my identity, now, especially with the whole NIN thing. Talking about yeah. the rights, right, and where the line should be drawn. So I was going through the cost, um, customer and consumer protection, which was actually released by the CBN mm. um, a while back and all of that. And it actually states that... Consumers have the right to know all their choices, mm -hmm. select the choices they want mm. without being pressured to do so. Yeah. And when they do every detail as regards that particular choice, she will be explained to them mm. in a detailed manner. Yeah. Yeah. To true. me, that interprets that you can't open up, no matter the information you have, except that expressly said, and you explain to me, okay, fine, this is what the um, Naira account is going to be open for you. Yeah. Have, you and all tried, of that. have you ever tried So if it's not, account? it's really, it's, 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 so it's so almost impossible. Bring your grandmother's Left finger. It's, 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 it's a ridiculous Nigeria. process that yeah. is almost impossible. Yeah. I, like, I just like what you said. Yeah. This yeah. comes in, follows up account. I told them I don't want text again. Send exactly. Me email. Yes, because you know, I don't yes. see. I don't see your text check your for text a month. Is three hundred and sixty. So I think everyone should actually go through because yeah. this is by actually by the CBN yeah. and should yeah. know your rights so that you know. I mean, when the bank is definitely. Yeah. It's actually really, and I, yeah. I do believe there should be a limit to the number of accounts one individual should, should be able to have. That is true. very true. Yeah. You know, if you've experienced this, still let us know. Use the hashtag Wake Up Nigeria on uh, um, TVC. Hashtag Wake Up Nigeria on TVC. Mm -hmm. Yes, and maybe let's start a movement. Let's stop all of this. Um, mm -hmm. I call it uh, what's what's the word haranguing mm -hmm. into one of those rubbish thingamajig. Mm -hmm. But tell us what you think. Use that hashtag I told you from before. We'll be back.